Welcome to the College West Angular. This is the Motor Vehicle Workshop. My name is Alex Meads. I am the Level 1 Course Director. Um, we run three courses in here. We do an um, Introduction to Motor Vehicle and Engineering Level 1. We do a Level 2 Technical and we do a, the Advanced Level 3 Technical. We have a full, fully equipped workshop um, with seven ramps. We have a fleet of around 30 cars that you'll have the opportunity to work on. Over the course of the year, you'll cover most of the basic systems from chassis to engines, electrical, um, liquid and lubrication um, and cooling, as well as wheels and tires and the fast fit areas. Um, we will cover, depending on what level you are doing, on level one, everything could be a very basic course. So we'll do the inside, so we'll start from all the basics from the brakes and steerings, whereas level two will go into more in depth. And as you go on to level three, we'll hit the diagnostic marks. Um, so we'll use the diagnostic equipment. During your time here, um, you'll be in a workshop full of fully qualified mechanics ourselves. Uh, myself, I've had 16 years in the industry um, and everyone else is far more greater than I am. We've come from a range of backgrounds, from main dealer to independent to the forces. Over your time here, you will primarily be based in the workshop. Um, there'll be a 50, round of 50-50 split between practical and theory. Um, the theory will be done up in our classroom inside the tower block. Um, and in there you will learn study skills, how to do build a portfolio and all the theory side to the course. Whereas in the workshop, we will teach you the practical side. We do expect all students to follow the college um, rules and regulations, uh, making sure they wear the lanyards at all times, making sure they stick to the correct areas of the college um, and stick to the rules. Um, we try to have a good time in here. We are all real people. Um, we've started in the industry ourselves, as I said. So we try to bring the industry to us as much as we're allowed to. We do expect you to stick to your college days. College days normally are between, between three days, three to four days, um, depending on if you're doing maths and English or not. Um, you will have to do your ICWA, which is um, done on, on Learn, our online Moodle platform, um, and that is done by our progress coach. So you'll need to do that, that's an hour, uh, hard, three quarters of an hour a week. Um, and that should cover that. You'll also have to do work experience, which is 60 hours at this current time um, over the course of the year. Um, and you will also have to do self-study time, which is 35 hours for level one and around 60 hours for level two. And that's done in the LRC. Um, and that's where you'll get chance to use our online smart screen platform, which is done by City and Guilds. Um, and you'll be able to get through extra learning resources that way. While you're here, you will need to purchase your boots and overalls, which can be bought on the college website or at the college shop. You will need British standard safety boots and college logo overalls, which have to be worn inside the workshop. Um, you're not to wear them outside the workshop, though, for cross-contamination. You do not need to buy your own toolkit. Um, we supply, we have all the tools you could possibly want in here. We have um, fully filled toolboxes. We have all the diagnostic equipment. You know, if you can't find it in here, realistically, you're not going to need it in a garage, um, but we have everything you could want. Like I say, we've got a fleet of 30 cars as well, so there's plenty of options to work on. We also have live cars coming in from staff members um, and various students that you'll also have the opportunity to, um, to work on and to build your skills on. And the type of person you need to be while on this course, or to be able to get on this course, you need a good level of maths and English. Um, grade wise for level one we're not overly concerned as long as you have a good understanding whereas it comes to level two you will ideally need that pass mark of that grade four or C. Um, main reason for that is there's a lot a lot of information that you need to take in it's a very um, heavy course in the first couple of months um, after that first couple of months you will have to set a exam on the level two and which you only get two attempts and you'll have to do a synoptic as well which is a practical um, exam which will be take place in the workshop over two days in exam conditions with the level one um, there will be one exam which is a multiple choice and there'll be a practical synoptic later on in the year as well but we're still looking into that bit 
Um, whereas the level three will run in the same way as the level two, you will still need to have maths and English. You will also need to pass the level two qualification um, and it will work in the same way. It will be heavy loaded at the start. You'll have a theory exam in February time and then you'll have your synoptic again, which will be in exam conditions in the workshop.